it is I never know what day it is it is Saturday November 10th and we are on our way down to Savannah I'm so excited this is for the um, YouTube moms meetup and it's mostly or actually it's only moms who live in like the south southeast really because um, I had a lot of you ask like why certain people um, weren't coming and it's just because it's pretty much anyone who can drive within this region but um we are on our way to savannah now we just filled up my car and um i'm so excited what's a road trip without chick-fil-a right So pretty. We are here and I'm so excited. I don't know why I'm not in focus. Our room isn't ready yet, um, but it will be very soon. So I'm, we're just trying to figure out what we're gonna do next. And he is ready to get up. He's been sitting for a while. Everybody on the vlog has been thinking about you and asking about you, you and praying for you. Thank you. I was just telling her that this will be like a good trip for us to like maybe like clear our minds a little bit and just have a little moment away from all the stuff that's been going on at home. But everyone has been asking about you on my Instagram and just saying they've been thinking about you. So. Thank you all so much for your thoughts and prayers. Keep them coming. Yeah, keep them coming. We really appreciate it. And right now, um, let me just show you this really quick here. Hold the stroller for me. So this is my hotel. It's the Bohemian. And I'm standing right here, which is just walking distance to Kara's hotel. And if you've been following my channel for a while, you guys know that she and I, whoa, look at that hair. She and I have become like YouTube BFFs. And I'm so excited because um, we're gonna meet her in just a second. Look who it is, you guys. <laughs> Oh, how are you guys? <laughs> so nice to meet you. <laughs> guys, we made it. I am like a sweaty mess. We sat down in the lobby for a while until the room was ready. And then I just saw myself. <laughs> There's a mirror right here and I saw my reflection and got scared. Wow. Um, but Kara came up to our room really quick and we're about to, she's going to get her baby and Rob and then um, we're gonna go get some lunch with them. But I wanted to give you guys a quick tour of my room. So I'll just start from the doorway. And if you open the door, ignore Bash's uh, stroller right here. But there is a big full length mirror. And if you're wondering what I traveled in, this is a denim shirt that's Brandon's, a white t-shirt. I think I got this at Target, some express leggings, which I love express leggings. And then I cannot remember where I got these shoes from, but they're really popular. So I'm sure you You've seen them before. But this was just my traveling outfit and I'm gonna change really quickly into something else. But when you come in, this is what you see. And I will take you into the bathroom first and it's a double door bathroom. This bathroom is just like the one in my hotel room tour when I stayed at the St. Regis. Here's a shower. This one, obviously the toilet. And then there's one sink and then there's the bathtub. And just like the other hotel, it has the doors here from the tub looking into the bedroom. Come on, buddy, come on. And then here is our room and it is beautiful. There's this gorgeous oyster shell chandelier, which is slightly concerning because it's over the bed. And the bellhop was like, be careful when you sit up, you could hit your head. <laughs> We're like, oh, that sounds so safe. And then over here, all of the furniture in here are like trunks, which is kind of cool. And then a little chair and it looks out onto the river. A little desk workstation here, a little seat, and then back around to the TV and the coffee area. And that is my room. So I'm just gonna get changed really quickly and then we're gonna go to lunch because Bash needs to eat like ASAP. All right guys, so I changed my clothes, nothing special. I was gonna keep the same thing on and then I thought, no, let's go ahead and change. I'm wearing my fur vest, which I think I'm gonna wear tonight too. A pink sweater, um, some jeans, and some over the knee 
brown boots and I feel like a pirate every time I wear these boots. I don't know if they're my favorite or not, but this is what I'm wearing because it is cold here. It's so windy. Hey, hi, it's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You are so handsome. Look, this is your new BFF. Oh my gosh, I have to get it. This is Sebastian. Hi. They're like reverse. They're um their color scheme. Our food just got here and we ordered calamari for me and my mom and then this is Bash's pizza which he is eating right now. Don't take, oh well, he's not gonna keep that on. I keep take, He keeps taking it off. My mom got lobster bisque and so did I and she also got a salad um, and my bisque isn't here yet. The time has come, you guys. The meetup is about to go down. I just finished getting dressed. I really didn't do much because I didn't have enough time to like redo my makeup, which I wanted to, but that's okay. I'm still wearing this vest, but let me, I'll show you my outfit this way. But um, I'm just wearing like a black mock neck with my Yod watch, this fur, a tweed skirt that I got from J. Crew, and these are my over the knee boots. I think you guys have seen these like twice now. But this is what I'm wearing tonight during the meetup. And we're doing like a two hour walking tour of um, Savannah. So I wanted to make sure that I had on flat boots so that I could hang or mama would be in trouble later. But uh, we're gonna go meet up with some of the other girls. Bashy, can you say bye to mommy? He's obsessed with these curtains. This is all he's been doing. This and crawling on the floor in here. Okay, 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 okay. I okay. walked out of my hotel and these three were standing there. You guys know Amy and Lauren and Brittany. Hi. We're so excited to finally meet. Yay. This is awesome. I know. I'm like ready to meet the other girls now. Now I know. Tara just came down. Everybody's gonna do it now. <laughs> We've met up with everybody. It's Meg, Amy, Kara, and all the other girls. I think I got everybody in there, yeah. <laughs> the star is so cute. Hi. I am having the hardest time finding a bag. There are so many pretty ones in here and I don't know which ones I want. But they're doing a really nice deal for us and they're giving us a bag and 20% off of anything else that we get. Yeah, what's your name? Yes. Okay. Are you guys just visiting or are you guys all like doing something? We're all here just to meet. Okay. Yeah. Have a great day. Great, thank you guys so much. Bye bye. It's called Savannah B. Oh gosh. I love the holiday stuff. Tupelo honey is known to be the gold standard of what honey should taste like. A uh, floral note to it, and then it finishes a little bit more like a Riesling or a Moscato almost. And if y'all want, at any point, I can take a picture of all of y'all, but this is actually a wonderful picture in its own. Here. So what's the easiest way to say what we just drank? Um, so it's honey fermented. Honey fermented cow wine. Cow. <laughs> so the difference mainly is that a wine is going to be fermented from grapes. Great. Right. Okay. A beer from wheat and barley. In order to classify it as a mead, it has to be fermented from honey. Interesting. You could what we just did was a mead tasting. So it's kind of like a wine tasting, but it's fermented from honey from bees. So it's not really wine, but um, I didn't even get to introduce it before we walked in, but that's what that was, and it was so much fun. I always say so much fun. I mean, it was, but like, I need to come up with a new phrase. It was so nice. I didn't really like all of them, but, or I think we did too, but I didn't like the second one, but the first one was really good, and there were more, but we have a dinner reservation, and we're a little bit late for it now, so we're on our way there. Walked up to the roof so that we could have dinner. That looks like it's gonna be our table. I'm so excited. Yeah, that's gorgeous. I had to put my glasses on 
because I totally left my contacts at home. But right now we are sitting at the Grove restaurant and the view is gorgeous. We just ordered our food and everybody is sitting at the and we're just having girl chat and nice dinner. So here's the pretty park. They're haunted trees. Dinner was amazing. I couldn't even finish my whole sandwich. It was so filling. But we are on our way to a haunted tour, and I'm actually a little bit scared. I don't like scary things. Like um, a few of them said that the tours here aren't that scary, although there is a scary one. But I don't think that's one we're doing. But right now we are trying to meet up with the tour. It's a two-hour walking tour, which makes me nervous because I don't like walking that much. But this should be fun. <laughs> and um. Hi. Oh my god, y'all. Girl, we're about to like fall <laughs> right? on our face. But uh, we're trying to catch up with them now. But hopefully, oh fingers god, crossed, we make it. Bad. Yeah, I'm, uh, we were just, we were like commiserating about the fact that we are terrified of everything. So scared. So let's see how this goes. <laughs> And the tour was really fun, but I can't lie, my legs are hurting so bad. And um, half of us came here, and the other half went home. But um, we're all supposed to meet up tomorrow at Forsyth Park, which will be fun. But right now, we're all just kind of sitting here in the lobby having girl chat and drinking water because <laughs> I'm just parched. I can't even. <laughs> it's just thirsty. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. So today is the second and final day here on the Savannah Mamas YouTube Mamas Meetup. Um, I've already gotten up and dressed for the day. I'm just gonna keep wearing this fur vest because I really like it and I only get to wear it like once a year, so now's the time, I guess. But um, here is my top today. I'm gonna wear some jeans and over the knee boots and just the vest again. And my mom is putting Sebastian in our stroller because we're getting ready to go have breakfast, just the three of us. And then after breakfast, we're going to Forsyth Park to meet up with everyone else. Ready to go for some breakfast? You ready to eat? Our food just got here. I ordered Bash some steel cut oatmeal and then I have bacon for myself pancakes and then my mom has like an American platter which has like a bunch of you can see what that is now are you ready to here we go here, let me get the, the bromance begins I know, right? <laughs> he get his feet up there we go sit down have him hold on to the uh, the bars <laughs> enjoying life right now first time on a swing so we weren't sure this is so cute <laughs> Park. It was just really cute to see all the little babies playing and Sebastian fell asleep like right before we um, We got out of the car to come here and I think he was asleep for like the first I don't know what 20 minutes or so and then he woke up and like was playing with RG and William This is so pretty look at that Really cute and now all of us are headed to there's some more of them right here to um RMC boutique because they have things that they want to give us as a thank you so we're headed there now and then I think me and my mom are going to head home it's time and then I still have to drive all the way home from my mom's house so we got to get going yeah
good little weekend getaway. We both bought um, the same sweater and leggings at the store and then she got um, another sweater as well. So I can show you guys that when I get home or maybe in another vlog. Because I don't know how long this one's gonna be. Yeah, remember? What's in here? Remember you didn't bring it? Oh, it's probably in the back. No, I had it with me. Oh, you brought it? Yeah. Oh, well, girl, I don't know. <laughs> um, but now it's time to head home and uh, get on the road, I guess. I'm gonna get comfy, take my shoes off, and relax for this three and a half hour drive home. Good morning, it's the next day, and I'm just about to end this vlog because I realized I didn't do it when I got home last night. But I just want to say a special thank you to Amy Darley for putting the trip together and a thank you to Genteel and Bard Savannah Tours, RMC Boutique, as well as Find Things Under $20 and The Grove Restaurant for having us in Savannah this weekend. I love that city. I love going there and spending time there and this just made my trip even better. So thank you all. And if you are coming over to my channel from any of the other women who went on the trips channel, welcome. I hope that you will stick around and subscribe and get to know us a little bit better. Let me know in the comments if you are and I will see you guys all in my next one. Bye-bye.